Why is this bill against offshore drilling needed and why is it important? You know, we represent the coast and people who live at the coast are very, very concerned about the prospect of drilling, whether it's near shore or whether it's further offshore. We passed a resolution here last session um, urging the feds not to be doing oil and gas exploration in the, terit in the federal waters. What we're talking about now is extending the moratorium here in Oregon. There's already a prohibition on doing this exploration off, co off the shore. We want to, that's about to expire, and we want to extend it, so our position will be to continue to not allow uh, oil and gas exploration offshore. Agreed. You know, our coastal communities are unique uh, across Oregon, and one would say, and any legislator would probably tell you, that their, that their districts and communities are unique as well. But with the fisher infrastructure that we have and the, how it uh, is so critical to our coastal economies, uh, when one looks at the possibility of, of exploration, uh, in those fishing grounds, it could be it could greatly impact those industries. We didn't start crabbing uh, until uh, uh, crab pots went went out today, uh, and so our crabbers are finally from Cape Blanco South able to uh, go fishing, and they haven't been able uh, crabbing, and they haven't been able to do that for for months, um, and so these economies could be impacted by. Uh, any exploration and or extraction in those areas that uh, that supply those local economies with, with those resources and revenues. And, and what we already know is the potential of finding anything out there is extraordinarily limited. Correct. So what we're talking about is exceptional risk for limited return and that risk impacts the fishing community, yep. the tourism economy, the, uh, the retirement community and people who, who come to the beach to watch the sunset on the water, not to see the, uh, the lights glinting off uh, drilling uh, platforms. Well, and, and also for me, you know, I, I, so I'm the, I'm the Republican on this bill and I'm there because I'm, I'm protecting those fishing in industry interests uh, because, you know, a large part of my local economy and my own community, 35% uh, for example, of, of Port Orford's local economy comes from that ocean and those ocean resources. And the amount of resources or revenues that could possibly be generated from any offshore uh, extraction and exploration would be minimal at best because they don't come to the local economy like our fishing resources do. Uh, they go elsewhere. This is a priority for the Coastal Caucus. The Coastal Caucus is a group of senators and representatives, Democrats and Republicans who represent, of course, coastal districts. And the fact that this is a, a, a bipartisan bill is an example of how we have been successful working across party lines to promote the interests of our coastal districts. It's an important bill and I, I expect to see it move forward. Yeah, agreed.